The 24-year-old gunman who carried out one of the deadliest mass shootings in U.S. history was sentenced to spend the rest of his life behind bars. And there's still a chance he could get the death penalty for the racist attack at a Walmart in Texas nearly four years ago. Donya Backus has the latest. A federal judge sentenced the self-proclaimed white supremacist who killed 23 people at an El Paso Walmart to 90 consecutive life terms. 24-year-old Patrick Crucius could still face the death penalty in his upcoming state trial for carrying out the racist attack in 2019 on Hispanic shoppers in the Texas border city. Of course, because Texas is a state with the death penalty, that is on the table, and the district attorney has said that he will seek the death penalty there. At the less than hour-long hearing, Crucius' defense attorney told the judge the shooter came to El Paso from his home near Dallas without a specific target in mind before winding up at the Walmart. If you have a broken brain, if your brain is broken and it's not processed and you're not under medication, it's, your, it's, what, it's what happened. All this uh, chronicalizing of his, of his activity, how he felt, what he did, we don't care. Somebody could have stopped it. Crucius pleaded guilty to federal hate crime charges in February after prosecutors took the death penalty off the table. To those that lost loved ones and were affected by this horrible tragedy, we offer our condolences. Crucius did not speak during the hearing and seemed to show no reaction as the sentence was read. The judge recommended he serve the sentence at a maximum security prison in Colorado. Donya Backus, CBS News.